Uh, hey guys, so we are here at the California Living Museum and we're gonna check out some holiday lights as you guys can see behind us. It's kind of a walkthrough at your own pace. I've never been here before, so I'm excited to check it out. Yeah. Yeah. There it is, California Wildlife. The clan as we enter. Park here. I don't know what kind of bird that is. Oh yeah, that's cool. There's a couple of possums in there. I used to see these um, in Anaheim. And every now and then we see possums and raccoons on the lot as well. So there's this cool turtle light. I like the cactus. Very active. Yeah, so check out these skunks, guys. Playing around. Oh, like, three. get me out of here. See, there he goes. Oh. <laughs> sorry, that was probably bouncy camera work. Sorry, guys. The big butterflies flying away. We're being summoned over here. Look at these frogs. The frogs are singing to this song. Reminds me of the Budweiser frogs. <laughs> Oh, these guys are professionals. Sounds just like it. Look at the little quails. Yeah, all the quails in a little row. I like it when they walk, they all do their little wiggles. Oh, look at this anthill. Those are big ants. I like that one. I like the butterfly. It's that song, the ants go marching one by one. <laughs> like Indiana Jones said. Big damn ants. Look, they're howling at the moon. Oh, there they are, howling at the moon. Fireflies. And the moon is made of cheese. Got his logs and stuff, making his dam. He's packing it down. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, look at this guy. Mr. Owl watching us from up above. Probably doesn't, sh you know, again, translate well on camera, unfortunately, but like this is super, super bright. It's actually really hard to look directly at. Can you guys see his silhouette there? And I'll zoom in a bit. I can't zoom in too much because it gets pixelated, but there's the long-eared owl. Yeah. So now we're coming back to kind of the main area. Big old snowflake right there. Going to the winter wonderland. There's snow on Oh, it's snowing. It is snowing. The winter wonderland area. But they got the snow machine pumping hard right here. Just blasting out, so. Can you, guys, can you guys see it? Look at my jacket. Soapy snow everywhere. <laughs> wow, so you guys can see how snowy it is. It's very, very snowy. Let me show you the machine. See it behind me there? Just blasting out snow. Oh yeah, so these, these guys throwing snowballs at each other. They're both getting pelted in the head. <clears throat> Uh, pole dancer? The lamp glider! The hell? The Mary Poppins! They're so mad! They're so <laughs> That would have been too easy of an answer. We wouldn't. Yeah, this guy's sledding down. He needs to be careful. I'm pretty sure he sleds into another dimension. These dogs? Critters? No, it's a, it's a wolf, and that's like an otter, and then there's a raccoon. And a fox? Or is that the fox and that's the wolf? I don't know. But they built a snowman, I guess. Or they're tearing him apart, I think. I mean, the yeah, guy's got his arm in his job mouth. Well done. So, and then there's the Santa hat. Such a violent scene here. Now we're going to on a safari. Here we go. Now we're entering the Congo safari. Yeah, so we're on a dirt path. A little bit of an angle here. Oh, the monkey's out. This guy's monkeying around. The lion over here, I think it's... Uh, gonna have a snack in a minute. He's watching the monkey. The Giant pink elephant. Love elephants on parade. You can hear it speak right here. Got a little bird on top. There's a, a zebra. A purple and white striped or, or a zebra. A purple striped zebra. Look at a zebra. A, a giraffe. Yeah, so these guys move a little bit. Oh yeah, he sprays water at this guy. Oh, poor elephant. Damn. 
Poor elephant. Yeah, a toucan and an elephant baited himself. Kind of reminds us of the Jungle Cruise. Yeah. It's like a Disneyland, only Don't with worry, they all have their trunks on. Oh, 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 oh. Baby, baby These guys are playing around. He just can't quite get the tail. But here's a look. So we've just been sort of gradually climbing a hill. You guys can see the pathway here and it continues up quite a ways. It's not a steep grade, but there's there's definitely a grade to it. And I just kind of wanted to show you guys for scale. So the green lights going around there are the pathway we just walked getting up here. And it continues forward here. And I'll try to raise the light. We're still on a dirt path. But we're heading up to the very top now. And there's kind of a lookout here. I have a feeling normally it's probably a larger enclosure out here with some bigger animals. All right, so this area here, some big horned sheep. And you can kind of tell, so, so there's a railing here near us. And then see where the lights are, go towards like the end of the enclosure. So it's quite a large space that the sheep has. You guys can see the train in the background. We're going to try to check that out a little bit later. But yeah, the sheep are out there just sleeping, just hanging out. All right, so now we're heading back and there's some bighorn uh, ram there. He's very fitting. Since that's the enclosure we just saw, uh, we're now back on a uh, cement pathway. So we're back on kind of the main path up on top. But even this is decorated. You see the inside, they have the icicle lights and it's like a, a really bright it's green. So I know on the camera, they, it doesn't quite come out well. It's a mountain lion and bobcat. Oh. Purple bridge. There's this cool little tunnel. Check this thing out. Here I go into the tunnel. I'm in the tunnel! Tunnel low light! Oh no! Where'd my light go? Blue! 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 Wow, this is a pretty crazy tunnel. It's pretty neat walking through. How do you feel? How's oh. it feel to be in the tunnel? It's really cool! Tunnel of light! I'm trying to take your picture! Oh, we're taking a picture. But kind of a cool little enclosure. Alright, so we're exiting this long tunnel of lights. And as you can see, it's got some settings to it. This is kind of trippy rolling around us but it's pretty fun they got all the different colors someone did a lot of work on that so the line is fairly long still we were hoping it would go down a bit but no worries we're gonna get in line and uh, ride this train this is what we're in line for the Central California Children's Railroad so we're still in line for the train this cool little model here pretty cool so in dedication for all of those who serve going to the front of the train. Oh. Now we're in the train. It's Martin's so very cold. excited for it. <laughs> yeah, the seats are made of metal. But and it's still 50 degrees out. And the people just got off. It says it's a seven minute ride and it's two thirds of a mile. Hmm. And, and there's two trains, so. This is the black locomotive with six coaches and a trolley. It says it, the rail is 6,970 feet of rail, 2,987 ties, 11,948 spikes, and it opened in 2006. There's a fun fact There we go, you guys. So you guys inside here, got Santa Claus, and there's that snowman that was hiding earlier. Look at the train. So we're moving pretty well here. It reminds me of Disney World and the lagoon. Yeah, the lagoon parade. Yeah. They're roasting marshmallows on the dragon's fire. And there's an oil well. That's a real one. It's real chilly. It's feel the wind in my face. Here's a water tower all lit up. Well, let me uh, kind of pan around. It's going to be on my side of the train. So the reindeer feed. So he's about to feed all the reindeer. And they're getting ready to go. The elves are putting the gifts in the bag from the toy factory. 
That's kind of a fun display. That's a really large one too. I don't know if you guys can tell. Santa's coal mine. So that's that's where he gets the coal to put in the bad kids' stockings. And in case you didn't know where you were, we are in the city of Bakersfield, California. Now I know here in California, a lot of cities have an arch like this, an actual arch in the city. It's just simply referred to as the city arch. Usually, I don't know if it has another name. I know Modesto has one. And a lot of cities throughout uh, California. If anyone's watching this in another state, um, and you guys do something different, for example, I know some cities do water towers. Um, let me know what you guys do. If it's something other than an arch or, or a water tower, I'd be curious to see um, what others do around the country. So let us know in the comments below. There is a view down at the zoo. And here's that condor we saw earlier stealing the fish. But here is a fake oil well. There is a Bakersfield sound sign coming up right there. Oh, yeah. Still sound. Still Buck Owens! Buck Owens has a huge presence here in Bakersfield at the Road Game Gastron building. a little shorter you can see there's the sign we first showed you I got the trees doing their little show ah look at this whole place it's very cool because it's um, since it's so large it kind of surrounds you and just seeing all the lights moving and doing different things so we found uh, on our way back here we finally found a menu so so pretty cool though they have a wide range of things and the prices aren't too bad so if you guys do make it out here, here's a little preview of what you guys can enjoy while you're walking around taking in all the lights. And check out this one. So we got this one here, big pinata. I like the guy's hat, giant hat. He's a big snake. He's uh, eyeing the gingerbread men. Hold on, I wanted to see the Yeti. Oh, there he is. Oh yeah, there's a Yeti. There he is. Oh, he's poking out of the trees. Yeah, so he's moving around up there. We can see him by the trees. Where's he gonna be at? Oh, there he is. Oh, he's kind of mean looking. We should leave him alone. But this is what they were telling us. Look at the snake. He ate a gingerbread man already. And he's eyeing those two. They're really cold, so we're gonna see if it's warm in here. It'll no doubt be warmer in here. Glasses are fogging up because of how yeah, it's hot. super warm in here and tons of tons of critters. Let's just show a few here. This is a banded gila monster, red diamond rattlesnake. Hey there, Mr. Turtle. Where are you going? I know you can't tell right away, but he's actually underwater. You know, it looks like he's just walking around. This is a Northern Pacific rattlesnake, and he's a little more active right now. And you guys can see his tail. Pacific gopher snake. It looks like my finger. Yeah, so he's he's really not that big, not as big as the other ones at least, but he's are those his skin or his poops? Yeah, those are poops. Hey buddy. Hey. Yeah, I bet you can sense the heat. And there's another in there, coiled up. Yeah, you can see. Pretty good size. Yeah, I haven't seen any skin shedding from any of these guys. It's probably not the right time. But these guys are in the water. Look at these big toads. 
Oh, these are actual bullfrogs. Is what it is. Oh, so this one has has a thing in here. It's a desert centipede, and it's venomous. So we just finished the reptile exhibit, and now we're gonna head over to the carousel and uh, I think see about riding it. What have you thought about the lights exhibit so far? I really like it, but good tip is bring a bigger sweater <laughs> or an additional jacket. Yeah, I suppose this if you're not used really to it, cool. it is a little chilly. Um, like I said, it's about 50 degrees out here this evening, so. But it's really fun. We haven't done something like this in a long time. Yeah, it's nice and as you can see, it's professionally done. There's a lot going on. There's a lot of activities and things to keep you occupied. And there is food and drinks if you want to do. Uh, it is cash only though. So if you do want to yeah. purchase any food or drink, cash cash only for that. But for the ticket purchase, you can use uh, debit or credit card. You're allowed to bring in foods and drinks just as long as it's like a closed bottle and um, no plastic. So here we are. Here's the carousel. What? A ton of work so thank you to all of those who helped put this on um, pretty impressive display of lights over here they have a rock climbing wall which is open during the normal zoo hours that you can participate in which is pretty cool so again uh, change of plans I am gonna ride as you can see I'm just on a bench though with Mars's mom Mercedes and her siblings are behind us. Mars is gonna sit this one out, but she's gonna film us from uh, the side somewhere. But we got lucky, this is gonna be the last ride of the night. All right, here we go. <laughs> I was just thinking um, when I was a kid, we would go to different places and like we'd go to other music parts. Or for example, I remember going to Pier 39 in San Francisco and they had a carousel. And I'd always, my parents would always say, hey, do you wanna ride it? And I'm like, oh, I don't know. And um, I think maybe the kicker, and I don't, it was a combination of me being undecided and my mom and dad maybe not wanting to do it. Um, but he's always like, oh, well, you don't want to do this one. You want to wait until we go to Disneyland and ride Disneyland's carousel, because it's the better one. So I remember growing up being maybe persuaded not to ride other carousels when I was a kid because we had to wait until we went to Disneyland. So <laughs> I still remember that to this day, but sorry, mom, I'm, I'm breaking the rules and I'm riding a, a non-Disney carousel. And with that, we slowly are coming to a stop. We're right at the exit. I know, we're right here at the exit, lucky us. Wow, look at that, quite a display. I didn't realize the tree um, did so many things. All right, so we wanted to stop here at the North Pole. You guys see behind us? All right, so we just entered our, or ended our holiday walk. Um, it was a lot of fun. Like I said, it was my first time. What did you guys think of it? I, love, I, I always love, love it. it. I I love it. Anybody have any favorite parts? Uh, the the calm code. The train. And the train, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I like the, the train. The tunnel of lights. Oh, that was fun. I like <laughs> that. Was pretty yeah, I, I agree. I like the abominable snowman display they had. It was kind of fun. And the reptiles were a lot of fun for some reason, even though it had nothing to do with the lights. But and it's this it's just cold. really warm in there, so it's nice and warm. That's true. Yeah, it's still um, about 50 yeah, degrees. So it is cold. cold um, but thank you guys, as always, for watching. Thanks for joining us. And hope you guys had a good time with us tonight. And we'll see you guys next time. Yeah, don't forget to like and subscribe. <laughs> Bye, guys.